A variety of Asian-inspired performances took the stage at the 11th annual Dragon Boat, Kite, and Lantern Festival, hosted by the Marco Polo Foundation. Well, Vietnamese, we even have some Latin American performances, and uh, we're also, the variety of performances as well, because we're going to have like Chinese cultural, like traditional Chinese instruments, and then we're going to have uh, singing and dancing, and so it's going to be really wonderful. Though the day involved a lot of rain, that didn't stop people from coming out and enjoying the festivities. We're celebrating Chinese culture, and of course the Dragon Boat Festival that's coming up uh, really soon, and so we're going to hopefully really soon have some races, <laughs> despite the rain. Uh, but we're also having cultural performances out here, um, and we still have quite a few people out here. We have Chinese food, we have a lot of food vendors and food trucks coming out to here today. And the food brought in a hungry crowd as there was lots to eat, from barbecue to, of course, Asian favorites. For some, the event is a chance to experience a whole new culture, while others are reminded of previous ventures. I lived in China for about five years, and so I really like helping out and, and being a part of the Chinese community here in Dallas. And, uh, and so I think it's just a wonderful opportunity to be involved. With music, crafts, and food, the Dragon Boat, Kite, and Lantern Festival allowed the community to celebrate the rich traditions of Asian American heritage and culture. Come out and have fun and experience a little different culture than maybe you're used to. For About Town, this is Susan Conway.